It's a story you'll only see on Way 31. A man buying up real estate in an area some call a rough part of town, all for the sake of service. Way 31 Sarah Singletary sat down with the man behind Good Cause Huntsville, who says he wants to bring light to some of the city's darkest areas. Chris Richmeyer has always dreamed of flipping more than a house. He wants to flip a street. Calling the city, getting a lot of street lights turned on, maintained. His street of choice? Knight Road in southwest Huntsville. That's the same street where, about a month ago, Way 31 told you about a shooting. The only reason why I don't have my kid over here is because, because of the crime. In 2016, Rich Meyer started buying up apartment buildings on Knight Road. He told me he owns about 40 apartment units on or around the road right now and 10 houses. He and his team, Good Cause Huntsville, are using every roof available to offer low-income housing to people who are homeless or just one bad day away from becoming homeless. The catch? You have to be willing to be a part of a safe and sober community. I've been an addict off and on for, like, 20 years. Glenda told me she knew she had to get out, so she moved into one of the Good Cause houses. Glenda, like so many others, didn't start off in permanent housing. Less than eight weeks ago, she lived right here in transitional apartments on Knight Road that are owned by Good Cause Huntsville. Now she's sober, living in a home, and says she's no longer just surviving. Instead, she's thriving. <laughs> it's just totally different. It's like another world. A world where she's no longer doing life alone. Instead, she's living with three other women. Four strangers turned friends after being brought together by Good Cause. And according to Chris, there's more good to come. He tells me Good Cause Huntsville is in the process of purchasing another 24 units on Knight Road, located just across the street from the scene of last month's shooting, bringing his team one step closer to seeing a street flipped and a community restored. In Huntsville, Sarah Singletary, Way 31 News.